Welcome to your daily love reading. Let's take a look and see where the energies are today between you and your person when it comes to love. This could be physical or spiritual. Uh, real quick, I'm only going to make a few announcements on a couple of videos. And um, I will be putting stuff on the community board. I know there's something going on and off about the sound um, with the videos. And um, I've noticed this in other uh, creator content creators as well. This is not the first time I dealt with this um, on YouTube. So um i'm i'm in the process of getting something i just did an order for us so hopefully that will work it out okay because this is not going to stop the party all right so let's just um get your message today we gotta still do what we gotta do baby all right so just bear with me with the video in a process until we get that in and hopefully that will fix everything okay make sure that you are also subscribed to your areas only placements love tara Okay, guys. All right, these are general. Only take what is for you and simply leave what is not. Okay, somebody here is thinking about um, texting you and coming over. Someone here wants to send a message to you. They're thinking about us and, you know, can we meet up? Can we talk? I want to see you. Somebody here wants to see you. Yeah, they do. Enlightenment. Um, they want to share. They want to know. They want a new beginning. <laughs> um, they want to tell you how they feel. You know, someone here is like, you know, let's work on something. Some shit like that, baby. Yeah, opportunity knocks. They want an opportunity. I heard a new and another opportunity. A new beginning. Someone here is praying um, to the angel of miracles. I believe this is the sixth choir. All right, so they could be asking um, their, the angelics to kind of help them. Yeah. All right, messages for the collective. Let's grab your oral. That's the overall energy. So this is somebody that do want to reach out to you. They do want to... Somebody here also could have some good news. Someone here also could have um, just put a down payment on a vehicle. All right. Yeah. <laughs> you shout into this person. They're still attracted to you. Peacock energy is attraction. It's to your sweetness for some of you guys. All right, let's see. <laughs> My niece in the background is yelling. This person wants to yell at you. This person wants to send you a beep. You know how somebody called you and like, yeah, yeah, you know, I just wanted to holler at you. Somebody here wants to holler at you. Ooh, leadership. This is someone here that's coming to, to, to leadership. They want to take back control of this connection. They want to lead this connection between you and them. Leo energy. Someone here also wears their zodiac sign on them. They could have a necklace. They also uh, could, I hope you see that Leo sign. They also could um, have a Leo tattoo. Something here could be specific about Leo season. They've been thinking about you. Something they some for some of you guys, they've been thinking about you since um Leo season, or this is gonna happen in Leo season. What is that, July? Money. Oh, yeah. Child, let's see what is going on. Yeah, I told you, they didn't purchase something. This could be someone here that wants to give you a little something. Mm, let's see. All right. I mean, it might not be, you know, the only expecting, you know, thousands and thousands of dollars, okay? With the page of pentacles, it's meaningful. It's good news. It's just not, it might not be as much as you were like at this uh, at the time, you know, maybe, you know, but it's something. It could be even something small for now. Maybe they wanted to um give uh, give you something. Look at that, the chariot. And they told me to split the deck open. Yep, they are stuck on you. Start, they want to heal. Somebody here uh, sees you um in a light where they want to heal. They want to heal this connection with you. You could be connected to a star seed, an aqua area, an area. Something changed here. Yep, the chariot, like I said, um here. Now, this could be someone here that's been wanting to talk to you ever since you walked away. Or they walked away from you. Okay? This is what it's looking like. Yep, the world court has been some time. Look at this. Temperance in the Six of Pentacles. Someone here feels like putting balance in giving you something or giving you... It's like they don't want to give you much, though. But, you know, I, I, I don't understand if it's like because maybe they can't. But they want to... They feel like this would open you up is what i'm getting here what else is popping up oh two more cards popping out nine of pentacles on a full card because they will feel like a fool for letting you go virgo energy sectorias to source area is very strong yep the magician yeah and now they want to manifest you back in that's exactly what's going on here so this is part of their manifestation this is what they want to manifest yeah they want to heal this. Someone here wants to manifest. They're manifesting healing with you um, here. They feel like doing something. Now, someone here, you could need like some help with a vehicle. 
All right. And this could be someone here, to be honest with you. They want to help towards that. They might not be able to give much now um, here. They don't want you. Someone here wants to connect themselves to you again. And this will bring the connection. Others of you guys, it could just be simple money. Um, someone here could be um trying to, you know, like, okay, because it's been a minute, what could I give to manifest you back in? All right. Um, others of you guys, this could be, uh, you know, someone here that feels like, you know, you walking away, they're, you're, they're, you're getting away from them. <sighs> yeah. And that blew up in their face and they're nervous about this shit. They've been holding back on enlightenment on what they're, they're in spiritual jail. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Because they misjudged their empress. If this, if this is somebody, this could be your divine masculine. You could be a empress. All right, let's get this angel number and get a little deeper and see what they want to do for you. What they have been stuck on. That's why memory showed itself. Okay, so we have six and nine. All right, let's see what's going on. Okay, guys, I hope you could see a little better because it was like, getting on my nerve. It seems like you can see the cards better. So we have six, nine. This is sent from your guardian angel. That is time to turn your attention to your family life. Oh, so the angelics have been working with them. They could be reaching out to their angelics. Someone here is looking at their love life. They've been sending back memories, thinking about you, and it's like they're let they let you get. Sorry, guys, spiritual burps, spiritual hiccups. They let you get away. They let you walk away. Mmm. Let's see what is going on. Hold on, child. What is this? What is this? So this is somebody here. To be honest, hold on, guys, one second here. To be honest, they are ready. Um, they've been actually sitting for a while about how to move forward, how to make this move, how to do this. Now, for some of you guys, this involves some money. You know, I mean, I feel like it's like a little something. You know, they want to give you a little something, and it's to show. And they do think about if that's enough. Why did they get this in? What was the distance here? What's the real card? They have been also manifesting from a distance. Overall, there's no swords. There's no cups. I do see fire energy, though. So this person's in fire energy because they're trying to manifest. But there's no swords here. There's no cups. This person needs to tell you the truth about how they feel. That could be what they're wishing to do. What's the real card? Okay. Show me the real card. What's the real card? Mm. The night, yeah, they are. They don't know how to create it, though. They're stuck. They can't. Yeah, five of wands because of the term oil. Knight of swords. They need to do something fast or they want to. What's the five of wands? Um, you know, uh, also, you know, about something you heard about whatever, the, you know, I heard term oil. That's what the ancestors said. What's this? Thank you, Holy Spirit. What's the five of wands? What was the five of wands? The four of cups in reverse. And the Ace of Pentacles, they want to they they want to come back brand new. They they want to put this behind y'all. Yep, Nine of Swords. They're nervous about it. Show me something else. Show me something else on that uh, Five of Wands. Passion, jealousy. Someone here tried to make you jealous with somebody else. Yep. Solitude. They could have went cold on you and that really made you see this person from a new perspective and put your boundaries up. Or they tried to make you jealous, period. Yep, betrayal in reverse. They want to take that shit back. Um, they could have tried to use something, like some kind of energy. They could have gave something more to like somebody else or something. What's the Six of Pentacles? Because the Six of Pentacles is also about uh giving somebody else something more than the other one. But in this deck, um, I believe this is Fran. Yeah, Fran has all the gifts. What's the Six of Pentacles? This could be what they feel like they owe you as well. They you they owe you. They're trying to manage. They want to do this. What's the um Six of Pentacles? Seven of Swords in reverse. Uh huh. This person here. Yeah, they want to. They 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 or they want to come back. They're stuck on you. They feel like you're stuck hanging, seven of swords in reverse, and a hangman, and you're just walking away. It's like, yeah, knight of wands, they're stuck on you. There's a lot of passion. 
Yeah, three of wands. That's what they've been thinking about, the five of pentacles. But it's like they don't know how to stop you. It's like they're right behind you watching you just keep walking. Because the eight of path is like a man, a woman on a journey. They're right behind you and they, they, they don't know how to stop you. And it's like they're just, you might feel this person's energy all around you, but they don't know how to stop you from walking. Um, let's see what, what's going on with this hangman. What's the hangman? Why is the hangman here? What's the hangman? Some of you guys like to wear tank tops and stuff with your jeans. That looks nice. Now, in this deck, I always will let you know, you see this hangman here? Um, we're going to get the amethyst crystal. Someone here could wear a man unit. Okay. All right. And I just got to point that out because that's a lot going on out here. Uh, here, the hag man. Yeah. See, the thing is, this is somebody nine of cups and Capricorn energy. They are just extremely determined. What's the um, hangman? They feel like a fool for letting you go with the nine of pentacles on a full card. Like stupid the king of pentacles yep now they're stuck on this is why they want to do something for you yep and this is the i told you get power back leadership um they're doing this slowly they're slowly making their way and this is to open you back up that's just what's going on here let's see what else what else is going on hold on okay they gave me some options and i'm gonna rock with this what else is going on here? Yeah, honey. This person can have like a narcissistic trait to them though. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. And for some of you guys, that could have got into it. I told you. They could have gave you their middle finger and tried to make you jealous. Um, But they want to do something. Now, we got billionaire. This could be a lot of little things that add up to a lot. But they called you a bitch. I could have been calling each other bitches. <laughs> <laughs> what? Like, what else so is going on here? Let me see. You guys, make sure you guys still. Yeah, I just feel like you can see better. So hopefully this is helping with that. What? What else is going on here? Oh, unicorn. Yeah, the uh, the magic, the the hocus pocus is leaving this connection. Yep, and that's what they've been thinking about. Memories and legend. Um, they're thinking about how you know you you don't feel the same. Yep, red flag. You don't feel the same. They know it. They sense it. Like, they could feel it. Yeah. All right. Give me some energy here. What's the energy? Show me. What is the energy? So some of you guys could live in a city with R in it. This could be uh, North Carolina. This could be New Jersey. New York, uh, someone here is connected, to, yep, to the Palestinians. Solar store, uh-huh, this person is, um, out of town. This is, somebody here wants to take you out of town. So you guys can, can, can connect. This is someone here that really, really wants to dig deep into your intuition, um, intuitively. Yeah, this is a very central thing they want to do. Um, it's supposed to, like, promote some kind of feelings back. That's what they're, that's their aim. That is their goal. All right, let's get this love real cool. That's what they want, honey. Uh-uh, they said these cards. All right, let's see. Messages are in here. What's the love, Oracle? Yep, chemistry. <laughs> they missed the chemistry. Um, They want to the build this chemistry back. This is someone here very soon. Now, what's very soon to you could be very soon, Um, could be different for them here. Yep, past life relationship. This is somebody from your past. Um, they want to do this real soon. All right, let's get your signs and planets, and then we will get you uh um oracle vibration today. All right, and um, yeah. Honey, I mean, they've been thinking a lot, baby. And this could be somebody here that want to take you like on a trip out of town, and then you know, everything's on them. You ain't gotta worry about money, or you have to spend a very little bit of money. They might even give you a little bit of money to spend. It's like you know, showing you they care. What is this? Aries, first house. Yep, this person wants to show up. The first house was also about arrival. Scorpion, this is somebody that's going to pop out at, like out of nowhere. You know, you could really have gotten so far with the Eight of Cups on this journey away from this person that you possibly never thought that this was going to happen. Um, Yep, Virgo, the house of health that they want to heal. All right, let's get you an angel. 
oracle vibration this is just an oracle vibration this was a very a straightforward message today okay guys so i turned the light back on for this part we're going to read memories i'm actually going to pull the card up yeah this person wants to take a leap of faith dove it says leap of faith so we're rocking with memories see it just seems like the lighting today is off but i think you guys can see it really good Okay, cherish the memories of loved ones. When you lose someone dear to you, it leaves an everlasting void. And with it, you lose your personal sense of peace. You may be one of many who believe your loved ones are still around and you want to strengthen your connection with them. You can do this as there is more going on behind the veil of God than meets the eye. You will experience visits in many different ways. A familiar smell or nudge or a white feather. This is just them saying hello. Everyone has a time to return home to heaven. Mantra, my loved ones are well cared for in heaven. Um, Someone has been praying to the angelics and like I was saying earlier, this is your confirmation. Um, Could be sending energy from this person to you. They could have asked or prayed for assistance. And so the angelics are stepping in for you to feel this is someone that is missing you quite frankly and this is someone that doesn't want to give up on you so some of you guys it's your decision whether or not you want to continue connect or how you guys will heal this relationship a lot of you guys i feel like you know who this is it still might shock you though all right all right i hope this helps you out in more ways than one guys i love you all um don't forget to hit that bell hit all that keeps you tapped in tuned in and notified when your messages are uploaded for you guys all right i will catch you the next time you stop by in your next video. Upload, baby. Ashe and Amon. Oh, and good luck to you guys. Ashe.